Well, that didn't work. <laughs> I, I, uh, I. <laughs> I don't get it sometimes. Um, I think I'm just cursed with the, uh, issues. I'm just gonna go start packing. If anybody comes and watches, they they, they can watch. Uh, I'm gonna do this till the battery dies. All right. Let's just set it right there, and I'm just gonna I'm gonna start packing. If people are watching, I just had a bunch of stuff I was gonna pack here i got steve strahd he ordered uh, some guide blades and he and he wanted the he ordered the uh, ac cobra and the uh, pink cobra ac cobra so he ordered these two cars so um we're gonna wrap these up for um steve and uh get these shipped out for him today and he ordered uh, two guide braids So we got that packed up here. We got some cars, guide braids. This guy ordered uh, a set of all the extraction pit kits. So we got these, we ordered these. What else? Oh yeah, I made some um, Hoppers, I gotta get some hoppers. Let me print my labels here. I'll just hit this right here, right now. I'm just doing this for the fun of it, guys. I, I'm not really, uh, I gotta, uh, I'm going to my other warehouse later today. And um, I gotta leave around two o'clock, but I wanted to, I think you guys like watching my podcast I think I think you like watching this show <laughs> did you see the picture of my wall I oh my my thing died here let me show you this real quick again before I we um, we get screwed up here it never fails it never fails I, 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 you know, I, I really think I'm numb fingers today. See what I did here? See, I made the con, I made a concrete wall. Okay. Yeah, just some little things. This is not staying on correctly. Yeah, it's the secret vault. I have a secret vault. I can't tell anybody where it is because that's where I get everything from. And I don't want anybody to know about it. <laughs> All righty. It's not just that. It's where I, everything I get. Um, uh, first class, three ounces. First class, four ounces. First class, six ounces. First class, ten ounces. A lot of small stuff today. Which is okay. I mean, it's it's just... It's... Um, Selling little by little, little things here and there. Um, it has to be, you have to have a, the only reason, the only way you, you make it in this thing is you have to constantly, see, I'm not necessarily a big, how, how many have I done today? No, I, I want to know if it's constant, you know. If I sell one, I, um, I'm happy, but if I sell two, then I kind of I kind of think it's a trend, and so I'll buy more. That's like on all the Auto World cars. I wish I'd now because this was back in 
Uh, last year, I bought the barn finds. I only bought one case of barn finds. I, I wish I had five cases of those. Duh. But I didn't have the demand back, back then. Plus, I didn't realize how far that this would be going. But I, would, I mean, when barn finds came out last year, good morning. Thanks a lot, Tom. Great. Thanks, guys, for watching. This is a quick video. This is going to be like uh, 10, uh, let's see, what is it, 1045, maybe 1130, because I've got a lot of things I want to, I've got to go to the bank today. And, and so I, I'm just, but I wanted to just kind of, you know how this is, shipping with Brian, just doing shipping with, with you guys. Uh, I don't know, you guys enjoy this. Uh, so Chaparral, Chaparral, C-H-A-C-H-A-P. Plus I had another order that I screwed up. It's because I'm not uh, I'm not watching where where they're going, and that's my problem. Batmobile. Yep. That's the problem. Yeah, that's a better angle right there. Do you think like you like that? Yeah, I do. I like that too. Yeah, good, good camera angle. All right, so two cars. These are for these. Batmobile. I need a Batmobile. Um, that's for the body and the guide plins and the chaparral. This is a nice car too by MRRC. Chaparral. It's a nice car. All right, let me go get uh, let me go get some stuff here down the Tyco aisle. Tyco aisle. I got some bodies here, but it's not a Tyco. It's a uh, Tomy AFX body. I got all these Tomy AFX bodies. These are cool, like that. But it's a it's a NASCAR right here. NASCAR body. And I need another Batmobile. Huh. I'm out of Batmobiles. Oh my gosh. Holy cow, I'm out of Batmobiles. Oh shoot. I'm out of Batmobiles. You know what that means? Holy cow, 330s? Do you want to hit? You want to know the history of my Batmobiles? So I got back from. Uh, I got back from the um, Toy Fair. Was it Toy Fair? Was it Toy Fair? So we're going to go out and do a sea container, guys. I tell you, this year for crickets is crazy. Anyways, this is the workshop. This is the shed. This is what I was blessed with about 20 years ago. I was I was given I was I had this uh, uh, shed, you know, a typical shed, you know, you have eight by ten shed, and I had it, you know, two of them together, and um, that was my workshop. And when we had our sixth child, I said, Kathy, we need a house, so we had to get the house, which is that house, and but next to it was this 2,400 square foot barn, and. Um, It, it just was crazy. So here are the two sea containers I have. So this is one sea container that's just filled. Okay, I can't have that thing in there because the metal shuts it off. So I'm going to set this here while I find the 330, okay? So give me a minute. You might not be talking. You might just see me, okay? So I'll just set this right here. Hello, Ron. I gotta find that box. My Batmobiles have been popular. I 
I hope I don't sell out of these. I don't find I can't find any more 330s I know I have more 330s this is my other sea container filled with with stuff all right now I'm beginning to worry um Where's the other 330? I had five cases of those things. I know I. Now I gotta find it. Now I'm going upstairs. You guys have got a treat today. I'm all over the place. I'm everywhere today. Off-road. These are all off-road sets. Head to head. Head to head. California cruising. Stock car showdown. Um, I got a problem. I uh, I don't know where my three three thirties are. Three three nine. Well, I'm gonna have to send him a. I have Batmobile, but it's. It's not that bad, Mobile. It's they came out with an assortment three five eight. Same Batman. Same car, it's just different um, assortment. So I'm gonna have to send him that one. Okay, now I have to go, when, I, when I'm offline, I'm going to have to go to the sea container and uh, check all those numbers again. Because I think I have another one. Chaparral. Oh my gosh, this is too funny. Ah, uh, this is too funny. It's just too funny. Alrighty. Alright, so we got the uh, snake mongoose set that's been sold. 
I can't really read. Okay, what are you saying here? I will be uh, in the last place you look. Yes, Ron. Ron is back. Well, it's got to be in C container one because that's where I put all the new stuff. Um, and uh, it's got to be in there. That is Steve Stroud. We're going to do his in a minute. Did everybody check out Steve's video about his awesome skill electric layout? That's the, <laughs> that's the cool thing is, uh, is what you can do with your layouts. Um, it's all about a hobby, guys. It's all about a hobby. And that's what I'm trying to provide is everything you need to do your hobby. And uh, that's why we're uh, getting the store. Um, we'll have Pro Tinker Toys. Uh, like yesterday, I let everybody know that I finally purchased the bill. Well, I haven't purchased it physically. I haven't had the closing yet. I was hoping to do that this week. They said they had to do it in six days. Um... But I guess all the lawyers have to get their cut. Um, it's going to take a lot of work to organize the shed. All the stuff in the shed has to be moved out. Oh, brother, I, I've done that three three times. I don't, I've done it three times in my life. I've done it with um, Rarities and um, Pro Tinker Toys or uh, Professor Tinker's Workshop. That was the name of the other store I had, Professor Tinker's Workshop. But I was 30. I was 31. I was 35. Um, I'm, I'm 60. <laughs> right. It's not, I mean, I don't mind doing it. Um, I mean, obviously, I'm going to hire a lot of kids to help me move all this stuff, but, I mean, there's a lot of stuff in this shed. It's 20 years of, of, of buying. I mean, I've been buying stuff for 20 years. And so, um, you know, it's... Uh, Antonio bought three camels. I think these guys just buy stuff when I'm online. <laughs> that's my opinion, which I don't mind. I mean, I, I, that's what I want to be a shop at home type thing. You know, where you see something on here, you just end up buying it. Uh, we'll be getting, uh, we'll be getting everything. A hobby. Uh, I just sent in. Uh, for those that have been wanting me to get Carrera, I just sent in my application for Carrera. They already told uh, Ted I had already. I already got the catalog and everything, but um, um, all right. So we got four or five orders with Pro Tinker. I got Antonio Barr or Tony. Tony's buying three. Uh, I'm just getting an ocular migraine. Oh crap. How many get ocular migraines? I used to get migraines when I was a kid. Huge, massive ones. Uh, I wouldn't wish them on Obama. Um, but they are just, they were the worst thing on earth is a, a ocular migraine. Um, Anyway, what was I going to say? Let's see. Am I out of this star? Here, buying farms, you know, uh, cars don't do anything for me. How about a Studebaker? Ooh, I do have a good Studebaker. Let me see if I have a Studebaker. Ooh, I do. Easy. 
didn't say a gold one. Studebaker. I think these were cool cars. Studebakers. They didn't do well, but you know, I think they were great looking cars by Auto World. All right, so that's done. All right, so that can go in a 20 by 6 by 4, and that is 7 pounds. All right, that's good to know. Okay, and that's 8, 12. All right, and then we've got Porsche 911. Um, all right, so that's ready. Um, that is ounces. That is 12 ounces. I'll need that to 8, 8, 170. 8, 8, 170. And that is first class. And then uh, we've got Steve Stroud, um, eight by five, and that is 1.5 pounds, 970. Boy, two, I couldn't get that. Um. All right, so nine, four, eight dollars for that set. Eight dollars for that, and then f that should be four, three dollars. All right, so Antonio's is three dollars. All righty, how's everybody today? Is everybody having a good day today? I'm. Uh, I, I'll admit, I'm. Um, uh, that's a Studebaker. I'm having a good day, I, I guess. I can't complain. Um, you know, it's... Um, I've wanted to do this um, all my life, honestly. I... Um, no, I don't want. I don't want to say I want to do this. Um, I love selling things. I've been a I've been a seller all my life. I've I've always tried to make money. When I was a kid, we lived in the Imperial Trace apartments. I've always wanted to make money. I wanted to figure out how to make money. I would have carnivals during the summer to 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 make money. Um, how I did that, I have no idea. I just know that I did it. All right. So that's enough of me pa pa pontificating. All right, because I know you guys don't like me to pontificate, so I try not to pontificate. Um, all righty. Now, I'm going to print these labels, and then I'll mark on the labels who I need to, who they go to. Steve Strahd lives in Texas. That's all I'll say about that. Now, just to let you know about ProTinkerToys.com, the new building now. I bought Huntington Bank here in Wayne. We're going to have a big moving party, probably a Saturday or Sunday. And anybody that wants to come is, is more than welcome to come. We're going to have a big barbecue on a Saturday. Uh, we're going to play croquet on the on Saturday in the evening. Because obviously, we've got to get a lot of work done. So it's not going to be all fun and games. Um, so Antonio gets three... What does Antonio get? Let's see what Antonio gets. Three, he bought three camels, I think. Let's see what Antonio bought. He bought three camels. Three camels. I'll show them to you in a minute. And then this guy, he bought uh, parts, P A R T, and a start track. Start. Um, what did he get? Start track, transformers, and hand throttles. Hand throttles and transformer. All right, so that one's done. And then Scott Wine, he ordered, uh, no, Brian Drake. See, I just screwed this up. <laughs> I give up. Unbelievable.
Scott Hines. What did Scott Hines got? I tell you, I got a migraine. Do you know what a migraine is, people? Do you know what an ocular migraine is? Does anybody need... Here, I'm just going to take Steve's right now to his, his item. Does anybody know what an ocular migraine is? An ocular migraine is, for example, you looking into the sun, okay, and then you have that that glare in your in your eyes. Now, I've been over there talking, and I've been sh and and packing and everything. Now I forgot what is in the is in these boxes. So to be to be correct, I need to open it because that's how my brain is. Okay. All right. So this is Steve's order right here. Okay. So this is Steve's order. So I'm gonna put this in, and Steve's order is going UPS because uh, uh, they have a new uh, shipping thing. I'm shipping a lot more UPS. Now I have to open this because my brain is so out of tilt. Oh, I know which one this is. This is uh, um, parts kits. That's right here. Back to the Future Camel. I don't have Camel. Oh, I haven't done this guy's order yet. That's right because his was uh, delayed because I was out of one of the cars. I was waiting for him to call me back. Well, we got 13 views today. We've got four likes. Don't forget to keep commenting. The more you comment, the more. So, anyways, an ocular migraine is like your it. it there's like a an image that will go across your eyes and it and it it, sorry, it blanks out part of my uh, a vision. It's real annoying. Now, when I was a teenager and up till probably about thirty, when I got a migraine, my day was done. When I was 13, 14 in high school, when I got a migraine in high school, I literally had to go to the the uh, uh, nurse's station and just lie down in pitch darkness because any light would just my head my headache would get even worse. Uh, then I went to and my mom then when I was in high school she sent me to the university for biofeedback, and that was pretty cool. So I was sat in front of this computer. And I had to change the lights from green, from red to green. So it was red, yellow, green. And so I just have to sit there and concentrate with my mind to changing those light colors. And that was kind of to change my, my uh, cognitive ability, I guess, as you want to call it. Um, and I think that helped my migraines over a long period because now... See, the, do you know why you get migraines? Do you, know what the, do you know why you get a migraine? So in your head, there are blood vessels. And when you get the ocular, that, that, is, that is a vessel that is closing like this. It's just closing like a hose. You've kinked the hose. All right? And so that's creating that ocular, that, that image in your eye. Because that vein is shut, and so it's screwing up the, the impulses to your eye. Then after that ocular kind of goes away, that vessel then opens up. All right? And when that vessel opens up, that that all that uh, blood just, boom, hits the head of your head. And that's what creates your headache. That's what gives you your headache. Well, that's why I took the biofeedback so that when I'm, um, okay, so here is the other order that I missed. Okay. That's why I took the biofeedback so that when that, that blood vessel opened up, I was supposed to be calm. So if I was calm, then that, then that blood pressure or that blood hitting the brain wouldn't create a headache because I'm, I'm relaxed. And that's why now, like whenever I get an ocular migraine, I don't, I don't, I just like right, right now, if I, if I had an ocular migraine 20 years ago, well, 40 years ago, I just go lie down. Because I knew what was coming after it. But now I don't even care. I said, okay, got an ocular migraine. Good. All right, let's, let's next. That's, that's about what it is. Next. All right, so now we've got to get two hoppers and three, um, three, um, three, let's see, three of these for Steve. 
three of these, and then two hoppers. I need two hoppers. Two hoppers. Two hoppers. And three of these. Holy cow, I'm falling over. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I need to let I need people tell me how how is this uh, send me a, somebody send me a note real quick. How is the broadcast today? Is there any lagging? Because yesterday I wasn't connected to my Wi-Fi. I was just through Verizon. Now I'm kicked in my Wi-Fi and I have a stronger signal. So I need you to just say, just say, give me thumbs up. Just just uh, send a quick yes, great, you know, so that um, I know if um, you guys are getting a good broadcast. Well, I guess it's all over, guys. Uh, Varney and companies, uh, the betters out in Vegas have bet that uh, the Democrats are going to win everything. <laughs> so that's what they're betting. Um, so um, I guess it's all. We don't have to worry about it anymore. So, um, okay, so these are the two hoppers. I think that was the hopper. Yeah, two hoppers. So that's my uh, that's my history of migraines. They're not a big deal anymore. Okay, so Camel cigarettes. Isn't this funny how they used to have slot cars with Camel on it? Ridiculous, isn't it? All right, so Steve, I'm gonna wrap your I'm just wrapping your cars up here. I'll show down here. Just okay, so I'm wrapping up. Steve's either Steve's wrapping these up. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a double wrap for Steve or for for Tony, I mean. Now Tony's gonna get upset that I called him Steve. Steve's gonna get upset I called him Tony. Alright, so now we're gonna get a box for Steve uh, for Tony. Uh, we're gonna box that up here. Alright, so we got that. And uh, we'll put some paper in there. Protect that a little bit. And we'll put that on here like that. Okay, that's done, that's done, that's done. Now I need to get a transformer, a terminal track, and two hand throttles. Because what I do is I take, when I sell all these cars out of these sets, I take them out. I mean, and then I sell them individually, which is really smart because I have a whole, I mean, look at all these parts I have. I mean, I have hundreds of parts. Okay, so I need a terminal track. Okay, so there's a terminal track. I need a transformer. There's a transformer and two hand throttles. There you go. Okay, let's put that back up there. Let's put that back right there, okay? All right, so the guy ordered terminal track, th uh, terminal track, uh, uh, transformer, and uh, he ordered the tune-up kits. These, you should have these. If you have Auto World cars, you should get at least one tune-up of each of the tune-up kits so you have them. And then you might want to get a bunch of the tires that I sell for 164 scale. Just get like one each of all the tires. Have them in your collection. Same thing when 130 second. Look at all these tires I have. Okay, do you think I've got enough tires? Tires, 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 tires. Now they're scale electric. They'll work on uh, Fly, Ninko. They'll work on all the different cars. So you don't have to, you know... Uh, uh, be wondered if, if they're going to work on your uh, on your cars or not. So don't just calm down, everybody, calm down. All right. So uh, let's see. What are the comments? Let's see if. Let's see. Uh, hey, uh, sell that f uh, stuff empty. Those uh, tin seat. Oh, Ron Gardner, you love to just make comments. 
Man, there are a lot of comments today. Steve, Steve uh, is not upset, but Steve would like to know if he can have, if his cars have shipped. Yeah, they're shipping today, Steve. Steve, aren't you watching? Here's your here's your shipping right here, Steve. It says right here, Steve Stroud. You we UPS when UPS comes, I'm gonna throw it to him across the field. <laughs> Just kidding. But yes, your cars are going today. UPS. Not the postal system. Alright, so we've got this stuff packed up. And the tune-up kits. How many people saw my video on the uh, Grex airbrush machine? Now, they're expensive, I will admit. But you know what? They're the best airbrush machine. High-quality Grex airbrush. There we go, guys. That's another order ready to ship. All right, now I have to find 88170. 88170. Now I'm going to show you how I want, look for something. So 88170. So I have a list of uh, fly. 88, 88, let's see here. 88170. Okay, 88170 is six and overstock. So I have them in overstock, which is up here. All right. So, 88170. What car did he order? 88170. Oh, I know what it's right here. Eight eight one seventy. Oh God! Oh no! No! Ah! I can't believe I did that. What an idiot! Unbelievable! <laughs> For the love of Mike! Oh, gosh! <laughs> Anyways, that's the car. Now I have to find that car. The case is all broken. The car is probably missing pieces to it. Look at it. It's down there. For the love of Mike. Can you believe it? I, I, I tell you. I can't believe I did that. Can you believe I did that? Dropped it right 10 feet, 6 feet, or whatever. What the heck? Is well, I got another like out of I think. But I don't do that on purpose. I don't want to do that on purpose. Okay. Let me tell you something, guys. <laughs> I just crushed a car. No, I'm just kidding. Okay. All right, so the next thing I have to do is I have to... All right, so all this stuff is ready to ship. I can't... A guy ordered three of these, two of these Lolas and three of the... Um... You know what's really a pop... Okay, so here's what I need to decide. They have... Uh... Okay, so and this is investment. All right, so I'm going to give you, I'm going to do, I'm going to, all right, so what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to, I'm going to bring you into my brain, all right? All right, so Scale Electric told me that they have only 60 left of this car, all right? Only 60. Now, to me, these are just beautiful cars, all right? You should, I mean, everybody should just have one of these just for the fun of it. And they only have 60 of these left, and I just want to buy all 60. So nobody can, they have to come to me to buy them. You know what they are? I'm going to show you right here. Because <laughs> they're beautiful cars, okay? I'm going to switch the camera out because I want to do a direct camera shot on it. So Scale Electric only has 60 of these left. And I'm thinking, you know what? 
it's a lot of money, but I'm just thinking, you know, that's a great investment. These cars are beautiful. I mean, absolutely beautiful. So that's my dilemma. That's how I operate. Because I'm thinking, okay, so they only have 60. They're not going to bring these in again. All right. They're only going to bring them in once. And I've been selling them all about one a month. So what is that? Okay, one a month. You know, it take me about two years to sell out. So that's that's how I look at things when I'm buying them. Um, I'm, I'm a sucker for a closeout. Because... Um, um, I just am. I'm a sucker for a closeout. So that's my dilemma. I've got three right now, which is not enough. I, 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 I'm just, I should just say, you know what? Ship me the 60 units. You know what I'm saying? Well, this is, I'm Brian Young. This is ProTinkerToys.com, ProTinkerToys.com, shipping with Brian. Now, normally Tim is going to be in the video. He is going to be coming here on Mondays and Tuesdays from now on. And we're going to be doing a live podcast on Monday or t probably Monday, Monday because that's our busiest day. Um, and so, um, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Th uh, click, uh, give us a thumbs up. That helps us in our, uh, our algorithms with uh, YouTube. Uh, the more people comment to my videos, the more we get, uh, uh, it, it, our videos are then shared. So like when somebody jumps on YouTube, our videos will show up more and more. And the people just, well, well who's this shipping with Brian? What's this, what's this nutcase? Well, why am I going to watch a video of, of a guy shipping? Well, <laughs> I can tell you why. Because I got a hundred other kids or a hundred other guys or kids, actually guys that wish they were kids. See, we never grew up. See, I'm different from my dad is that he, my dad, this was 20 years ago here in the workshop. And I can tell you, he, I tell you exactly where he was sitting. He was sitting right there, right there, right near that pole. He was sitting in a chair. This whole building was empty. Okay. Sorry about that. So my dad was sitting right there. Okay. And uh, my, this whole building was empty. I had Legos over here, right over there. But I was working for Irwin Toy at the time. I was working for Irwin Toy, selling slot cars, toys, uh, Dragon Ball Z, uh, Sailor Moon, all that kind of stuff. He was sitting there in the chair, and he, and he looked at me, and he goes, he goes, Brian, do you, do you make, so you sell toys? That's what you do for a living? I go, yeah, Dad, I sell toys. He couldn't understand that. He was from old style. You know, he was World War II. You know, he was, you know, work all day, you know, party at night. He was a, kind of a partier and all that. He was a boater and all that kind of stuff. He had a boat. I'm not knocking my dad. You know, he he was in a different time, you know, and he um he he kind of got screwed up in his later his life, you know, and I I don't want to go into details about that, but I've always been into toys. I always love toys. I've, I've I've been obsessed with toys. And as I got grew older, you know, and, and I had money, I started buying all the stuff I wish I had. Um, so that's kind of uh, a little bit about me um, and uh, why I'm doing what I'm doing. Okay, so Brian, he gave me thumbs up. Okay, so... Um, all righty, so uh, now let's see what else do I have to ship up at, on eBay. Now, what is great to do? Here's some good news. Uh, here's some, let's see, another demo car for the racetrack. Yes, you're right. <laughs> do you have any? Uh, do you have a scratch and dent? Yes, I do. I do, Chris. I do have a scratch and dent. Quality airbrush, good investment. Yes. <laughs> okay, so here's the breaking point that happens on this weekend, Okay. On this weekend, we had more orders that came through ProTinkerToys.com that came through eBay. That is big news. For me to be able to hire my brother or my or my son is I need to be doing more business on, on my website, 
daily, consistently than I do on eBay. Now, that's not taking away from eBay. People say, well, you know, do you want me to buy from your site because, uh, you know, you don't have to pay the fee on eBay? Listen, I am not a person that thinks eBay is ripping people off. They are providing a service. And this is why, you know, I'm a Marxist, okay? Or not a Marxist, but I'm a, a capitalist. <laughs> I'm a Marxist. That's a really good comment. This is why I'm a capitalist because eBay is providing me a service to sell my products around the world and they're only asking about 13% of my margin. Now, I've been in business three times. I know what 13% is. That's what my rent is. That's what advertising is. That's what uh, electricity, that's a lot of things, okay? And if, if eBay is only taking 13%, yeah, I'll sell more because I have sold. Let me give you a history. I have sold more. I have. Okay, calm down, Brian. You're getting a little excited. I have sold to every country on the planet from eBay. Let me say that again. I have sold to every country, well, continent on the planet. I've sold to China, Russia, uh, uh, Australia is a huge. My big customer is Australia on eBay. Huge on, on Australia, New Zealand. Uh, I even sold to a couple islands right in the middle of the Pacific, right off of Africa. There's a little tiny island, okay? And uh, matter of fact, you know what? <laughs> Hold on a second, just for the fun of it. Uh, let's see, um, uh, map of world. Uh, let's see. Uh, uh, Africa, okay, so Africa, L let me just see here if I can find this, uh, what island, uh, oh, it's Sorkaka, Sor see, it's off of Africa, it's S-O-C-O-T-R-A, amazing, so that item, th that person got on their, their, computer in that island off the coast of Africa and typed in matchbox cars and they found my matchboxes they bought a box I sent them to them you're not telling me that's amazing I think that's absolutely amazing but what's amazing is that I have on Saturday and Sunday of last weekend I sold more at protinkertoys.com that's protinkertoys.com don't forget to like and subscribe hit the notification bell and also subscribe hit the notification bell and what is else let's see Click the notification, share. Yeah, we did. I was going to do something, but my kids are outside. I normally take a, a, a package of, uh, of uh, M80s and I throw it out my door as their kids are playing in the yard and, and they just they go crazy over that kind of stuff. Um, I just think it's kind of fun. All right, so it's uh, 11.25. I'm going to go for another t uh, 10 minutes here because I've got everything shipped out. I got Steve's uh, stuff done. I got Tony's stuff done. Tony uh, ordered three of the um, uh, uh, camel cars, uh, Datsun camels. I also have that Datsun car in a, in a white camel so you could do your own decoing. It's basically a kit. Plus, my battery's about to die. It's at 36%. I'll go for about another five minutes, but I have that Datsun, too. So, uh, And then uh, Ma uh, Mega Traction, M MG, Auto World. The two packs are great deals. Le Mans, Porsche, or Peugeot. That's a Peugeot. Legos, if you want your kids some Legos, I got... Uh, building blocks, great Legos. We got them in 500,000, 1,500. Great deals. Okay, guys, listen. Uh, I want to thank everybody for uh, watching today. We had up to uh, 13 views, uh, uh, 18 uh, comments, which is great. That's great al a analytics. Um, a lot of people shoot. We had a lot of comments. Another demo car for the demo lunchtime. Thanks for the show. Um, just a lot of comments today, guys. Thanks a lot. I want to thank everybody for watching again. Uh, and just keep sharing the videos to all your friends. 
and uh, all these products will go out today, and we'll be doing a video, I think, tomorrow, because I've got some Scale Electric coming in tomorrow, so I want to show what I've got Scale Electric. Carrera's coming soon. I'm going to be doing a lot of Carrera Go. If you've got Carrera cars that you'd like to order, give me a list of the type of cars you like. Send me an email is the best way, so I can add those to my list, okay? Because I'll be placing a Carrera order probably tomorrow, uh, next week. Bye.